Saturday. Um, I literally just woke up. I look crazy. This officially begins my like intense studying for finals. I am exhausted already, but um, I'm gonna get out of my room and really just like try to get a lot done today. I have a strict study schedule, so I'm super excited about that. <laughs> I'm ready, like to just push it out, churn it out these last two weeks, and then, you know, actually get to take a break. So I'm gonna get ready, and I'm gonna try to look cute so I can, you know, motivate myself to not go back to sleep, and um, hopefully I get some good studying in today. Okay, so I am dressed and I'm ready. I was gonna do a full face, but I really did not feel like doing all that. I need to go get a full body mirror, but the Wally World is far away and Target is expensive, so I'm just gonna wait. Um, but this is what my study schedule is looking like. Today, I will be doing health assessment all day, and then tomorrow, health assessment in common. Um, Monday, I'll do common and read over my foundations notes that I've already finished. Then Tuesday and Wednesday, strictly patho. I also have my sign off for um, foundations for the straight cath on Wednesday. And then on Tuesday, I have my head to toe sign off for health assessment. Um, Thursday, I'm going to do common. Friday, health assessment and patho again. And then Saturday, I'll do two hours for patho and two hours for common. And then Sunday, foundations because I have my foundations exam on Monday. So I'm on the way to my studying destination. Um, I don't know. I'm excited. It's almost 11 o'clock, so I really need to get going um, because 5 o'clock, that's the time I usually leave. So if I can get five good hours of studying in, I'll be pleased. Um, and that will be super good for health assessment. <laughs> around four o'clock I know my hair looks like wild but um I want to say it's 4 30 almost five I just got back I got in the shower um and I was supposed to be there until five but um it was just a lot of high traffic in there and I was like mm, I'm just gonna head out so I left a little bit early, but I got a good like four hours of studying in. So I'm super happy about that. And um, I put on my pajamas. I'm about to go heat up some dinner. So I made some tacos last night. They were chef's kiss, so good. So I'm probably gonna heat that up and then just, you know, relax um, because I'm really happy with how I did for today. Here's my planner, my beautiful planner. But I was supposed to just focus on health assessment today, so I'm really pleased with how far I got. I finished viewing all of my videos um, that I was supposed to view. Like, I completed my study guide, so now it's just a matter of, like, rereading them and um, practicing. So I think I might do, like, course point for an hour, which is, um, if y'all don't know what that is, it's just, like, questions, um, automated questions that we get asked. Um, and so it's not mandatory, but... I do use it to help me study and I've been able to perform really well. So I think I might do that for an hour on like one chapter or a couple chapters and then like read through my notes while I'm watching TV on the commercial breaks just to give myself a break um, because I studied for four hours today um, on just health assessment and I was able to get through a lot and I understand it all. So Good job, Nini. All right, so we have relocated to the kitchen. Um, yeah, my hair is like this because I was put it up while I was showering. We're about to make these tacos. So excited. Um, I was trying to make empanadas yesterday, but they had they didn't have the frozen shells. So 
I was a little upset about that, but I'm just so ready to eat this. Final product, and I'm so excited. Yum, yum, yum. My beautiful candle. Let me move it, because I might. But y'all, I don't know what it is, but ever since I've started nursing school, I've literally been obsessed with Dog the Bounty Hunter. So, it was a priority that I found my glasses so I could watch it while I eat dinner and relax. Tomorrow I'll probably wake up um, a little bit earlier and get to the coffee shop a little bit earlier or I might stay here. I'm not sure what I want to do yet, but I like being out of the room so I'm not tempted to turn on my TV. Sorry, let me mute that. <laughs> I'm gonna hurry up and eat now because my food's getting cold. Good morning. It is almost 12 o'clock. Um, I know I said that I wanted to have an earlier start today and that was definitely my plan until some circumstances that I could not control, um, some craziness happened and now I have to go deal with the bank. So I've been on the phone with the bank. Um, all morning trying to figure everything out um and i'm just very irritated my eye over here is just going crazy um i don't know why i think it's just because i've had way too much screen time so i'm gonna put in my eye drops um these are over-the-counter eye drops that were where are they <laughs> that were given to me by um, an eye doctor that I went to go see during the pandemic um, because the typical eye doctor that I go to is it's not seeing people. So um, it's called Blink Tears and it's for, you know, it's like it's lubricating eye drops and you can put it, he told me to put it in three times a day when I was having like a lot of pain like under my eye just because I was having so much screen time and I also have blue light glasses. So I'm going to get up, get going. Well, I'm up, but I'm going to, you know, get showered and get dressed. I don't know if I'm going to go to the coffee shop today or if I just plan to stay here it is later in the day so I think I might go um somewhere to study just because I can't have any distractions since I lost all of this time so <laughs> it's gonna be a good day I'm not gonna let this morning you know mess up the rest of my day and put me you know in the dumps and make me irritated all day because you know this is just something that happens to everyone it is uncontrollable so please excuse the background but this is my outfit of the day i hate really being matchy matchy but i just love that these shoes kind of match the bottom and then i decided to wear my puffer vest today so i'm really loving this outfit combo um it is super cute and i am off to go study I'm excited um you know when you have a bad day or when you have like something that irritates you or a bad moment I've been working really hard to try to not let that consume my whole day and stay in a rut for the whole day and so I'm choosing to be positive I'm choosing to have a good day and we're gonna get some great study time in much much later I just got home um, and I was able to get a good like six hours of studying in so I'm very happy um, and I'm going to head to the grocery store now and pick up some things for dinner um, I'm super excited I was watching Lindsay's video last night and she was making Gigi Hadid's spicy vodka sauce so I'm gonna do the same thing that she did um, just because that sounds super good and it's quick and easy. This is the final result. I have some Texas toast and I put some chicken. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, y'all. So I just got out of the shower and I'm in my pajam jams. Um, it's been a great day. It's about... I want to say nine o'clock now. Um, I literally had so much fun like 
trying uh, Gigi's recipe and cooking. Um, I think that was a good break for me to just get my eyes away from the computer screen um, since I've been having a lot of problems with my eyes since the pandemic started. I love matching sets if y'all cannot tell already. Matching top and bottoms are from Costco and they're Calvin Klein. Love them. Um, super comfortable to sleep in and I honestly could probably walk out in this like it's super basic if I just put like a cardigan you know and just wear one some sneakers I think I'm honestly just gonna relax for the rest of the night I have my head to toe assessment on Tuesday I have that sign off and then um, tomorrow I have foundations at 9 a.m. and common at 1 30 um, so I definitely want to go to those classes because it's a week before finals just in case they have any feedback or you know tips for us and then I have tutoring and I have um, a work meeting so I'm super excited um, to just kind of be checking things off my list I'm really proud of myself for just pushing through because it's been super hard and um, I just think that today I could have you know just laid in my bed and been pissed off all day and been irritated because of what happened this morning but I really um, made a strong effort to you know just not focus on that and really you know get my priorities in order Link Lindsay's video below um, so y'all can see her make it because it was just so much chaos with me trying to film and cook and not burn down the house okay y'all so I'm gonna end the vlog here thank you so much for watching and keeping up with me um, and I'm just so ready to be done <laughs> with school and finish this semester. I'm so grateful and blessed to have all of y'all's support. Be sure to look out for my video. I was going to talk about my end of the semester reflection. See y'all next time. <laughs>